Number two national seed Texas has reached the NCAA Volleyball Final Four for the sixth time in the last seven seasons. The Longhorns defeated number seven national seed North Carolina in four sets Saturday to advance. And Texas has lost just one set in defeating four opponents in the postseason. The Longhorns will take on unseeded BYU at 6 p.m. Thursday in the semifinals in Oklahoma City. The winner of that match will take on the winner of Stanford Penn State for the national championship Saturday. The winning streak reached 17 in men's basketball in the Big 12 as the league went 4-0 Sunday. The Big 12 had a perfect week and continues to have the best record in college hoops, 78-13, a winning percentage of 857. Here are some of the notable outcomes. Number 14, Iowa State followed up its victory at Iowa Friday night with an 88-78 victory over Southern Sunday as all five starters scored in double figures. In the 90-75 victory over their in-state rivals Friday, the Cyclones were playing without second leading scorer Bryce DeJohn Jones, who was suspended. Junior forward Abdul Nader came off the bench to score a career-high 19 for Iowa State. The Cyclones shot 53% from the field and 44% from three-point range. On Saturday, number 10 Kansas lost a 21-point lead, but rallied in the final minutes to defeat number 13 Utah, 63-60 in Kansas City Sprint Center. Number 16 Oklahoma got 25 points from Tayshawn Thomas in an 87-68 victory at Tulsa, and Oklahoma State bounced back from its only loss of the season with an impressive 73-55 victory at Memphis. And two milestones in the other two games Saturday, number eight Texas defeated Texas State 59 to 27, that's the fewest points the Longhorns have allowed since 1945. And TCU is 10-0 for the first time in school history following a 68-50 victory over McNeese State. And the Big 12 went 8-1 in women's games over the weekend, and here are some of the highlights. Kansas State rallied from the 10-point halftime deficit to, to defeat Oral Roberts 53-47. Iowa State, playing without starting guard Jada Buckley, overcame a slow start to defeat Arkansas Pine Bluff. 82-56, and ninth-ranked Baylor blasted Stephen F. Austin, 96-57. The Lady Bears are beating their opponents by an average of 36 points per game, and sophomore Nina Davis has been outstanding of late, averaging 32 points and making 46 of 59 shots. That's 77.9% over the last four games. For the Big 12 Digital Network, I'm Wendell Barnhouse.